Welcome everyone to a new video. So in this video we are going to talk about the resolution of racemic ketones. I did post a question on YouTube community. So if you have this kind of question in exam, then you can approach it in which way you can approach it. This is exactly what we are going to discuss in this particular video. So before coming to the actual problem, let me just give you a brief idea about the resolutions of various organic compounds. What does resolution mean? We talk about the basic questions about the basic. So whenever we talk about resolution, हमको पता है कि एक racemic compound. Let us suppose if I have uh, this compound, okay, this amine. So we write it as a racemic compound. इसका मतलब ये है कि this contains 50% R plus 50% S. Resolution का मतलब can we isolate 50% R अलग से और 50% S अलग से? ठीक है? Means can we obtain the then optically active form? Now, issue kya hai yaha par, we know this is a racemic compound and this is nothing but the pair of enantiomer exist. Matha, do enantiomeric pair hai, wo exist kar rahe hai, 50-50% form in this one and this one, okay? And both of them cannot be separated by any physical means. Kyunki inki chemical or physical property ek dam si hai. To, what are the methods that we can employ to separate such compounds? उस केस में हम क्या करते हैं हम इन कंपाउंड्स को रिएक्ट कराते हैं किसी कायरल एसिड से मतलब इन रेसिमिक कंपाउंड्स को हम कायरल कंपाउंड से रिएक्ट करवाते हैं ताकि व्हाट वी एंड अप गेटिंग इज द पेयर ऑफ डाइस्ट्यूमर्स एंड वी नो दोस डाइस्ट्यूमरिक पेयर्स दे हैव वी नो दैट दोस डाइस्ट्यूमर्स दे हैव डिफरेंट केमिकल एंड फिजिकल प्रॉपर्टीज मींस वी कैन सेपरेट दीस डाइस्ट्यूमर्स बाय मींस ऑफ कॉलम क्रोमेटोग्राफिक प्यूरिफिकेशन बाय क्रिस्टलाइजेशन बाय अ other distillation techniques because their chemical and physical properties are different so now we are going to briefly look at let us suppose if we have racemic amine let us suppose instead of the ketone we are given racemic amine so most importantly what is it? we have racemic amine we know that racemic amine can easily form salts with various acids so in that case what do we do? we train to carry out a reaction between racemic amines and chiral acid now, chiral acid, it can be your tartaric acid, it can be mandelic acid, it can be camphor sulfonic acids. Depend on that when you get the diastereomeric pair, it should be crystalline. That is the main focus so that you can easily separate the diastereomer via crystallizations and the other techniques. So, in the way the reaction is, what do you end up getting is the mixture of diastereomer. This means that in the reaction, you have these two pairs that are present. Now, these two are diastereomer, different property. You have just can easily separate them by column chromatography or as I said crystallization. Similarly, अगर if you are given with the racemic acid, suppose you have this acids, यहाँ पर again we know that अगर racemic acid है, we can carry out the reaction with the chiral amine. Chiral amine में I think जो सबसे common example जो which you must have been taught is the use of brucine, okay? Which is the amine. And also nowadays people tend to use this. Alpha methyl phenylamine, okay, this chiral one. Same aim hai is to make the pair of diastereomer in the reaction mixture, which can be easily separated. Apart from that, how acids ko kaise kar, kar sakte hai? Apart from reaction with the amine, what we can do, we can also carry out the reaction with the chiral alcohols. So what happens in that case? What do we form as an ester? We form a uh, diastereomeric pair. So here we can use chiral alcohol, it can be menthol. Menthol is very cheap, it's a chiral compound and easily available. So once you have a pair of diastereomer, you separate them and then you can easily hydrolyze under basic condition to obtain the desired acid as it enters very well pure. So how do we use it? We can use chiral acids and we can use chiral alcohol as well. So the two things you must know. Because in the options you could be given such uh, such uh, uh, examples as well. Apart from that, अगर 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 रेसिमिक एल्कोहल की बात आए सेम रेसिमिक काम को रिएक्शन करवाने का एल्कोहल के साथ बढ़ दूंगी लड़ने लड़ने कर देंगे डाइस्ट्रीनोमर उसका रिएक्शन कर दिया देंगे and then coming back to the amino acid one of the advantages of separating the amino acid is what we have is two what we we have is an acid as well as the amine so we can do two things. We can protect either one of them. We can either protect acid or we can protect the amine. वो उससे क्या होगा? अगर हम acid को protect करेंगे तो amine से हम salt बना सकते हैं। अगर हम amine को protect करेंगे तो acid से salt बना सकते हैं। Here this is exactly what do they are doing. They are basically preparing the benzyl ester of the acid. 
अंडर एसिडिक कंडीशन सो ये तो बेंजल एस्टर प्रोटेक्ट हो गया नाउ यू हैव इज अ फ्री एमीन सो बेसिकली व्हाट दे आर डूइंग दे आर कैरिंग आउट द रिएक्शन विद द कैरल एसिड सो व्हाट वी एंड अप गेटिंग इज द सॉल्ट फॉर्मेशन व्हिच इज अ पेयर ऑफ डाइस्टीरियोमर व्हिच कैन इजीली बी सेपरेटेड सो all and all what we are saying is basically whenever we want to separate a pair of an antimer or a racemic compound ko we have to convert it into either a salt or we or an ester or into a compound which can be easily cleaved so similarly in our case jo humne discuss kiya hai jo mera question pucha tha in that they are talking about the three methyl cyclohexanone so we must know what are, what are the properties or what are the reactions of ketones we can think about the imine formation we can think about the hydrazone hydrazone formation or semi carboxyl formation so we can think of n number of reactions we can think about the acidal protection as well we can we can have various chiral reagents like that so this is exactly what we are going to see ki unme se correct option kya tha aur wohi kyun so now coming back to the actual question so they ask the how will you are we going to resolve the three methyl cyclohexanone they could have asked any other ketones जो कि अनसिमेट्रिकल है एंड हैविंग अ कायरल सेंटर सो दिस इज अ रेसिमिक दैट दे आर टॉकिंग अबाउट एंड दीज आर द ऑप्शंस दैट आर गिवन टू अस वी कैन क्लियरली सी कि कीटोन की रिएक्शंस एज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड सो वी कैन वी नो दैट सच फीनोल्स दे आर नॉट गोइंग टू रिएक्ट विद द कीटोन सो वी कैन नेगलेक्ट दिस ऑप्शन एट द सेम टाइम दिस इज अ कायरल एसिड बट इट्स इट्स नॉट गोइंग टू गिव अस गिव अस एनी रिएक्शंस सो वी कैन नेगलेक्ट दिस ऑप्शन एज़ वेल we can think about 1 3 diol we can think about 1 2 diol one thing which we clearly know that ketones they do form the acetal and they do form acetal with the 1 2 diol jaise ki aapko yaad hoga ki agar main ketone ka reaction if we carry out the, right so what do we do we carry out the protection of ketones so ye exactly this is exactly what it is it is 1 2 diol and here what there is a chiral center so this is exactly what is happening here but before coming to that इसके अलावा देर आर वेराइटी ऑफ कायरल रिएजेंट फॉर एग्जाम्पल हेयर बट यू हैव इज अल सेमी कार्बाजाइड सो हेयर बट यू है यहां पर ये इमीन फॉर्म कर सकता है सिमिलर इज दैमी ऑक्साइड सो हेयर बट वी हैव इज अल सेंटर एंड हेयर बट वी हैव इज दिस नथिंग बट अ सेमी कार्बाजाइड सो हेयर ऑल्सो इट कैन फॉर्म दी इमीन विद दी कार्बोन कंपाउंड सो वट डू वट वी आर जनरेटिंग इज बेसिकली पेयर ऑफ डाइस्टर विच कैन बी सेपरेटेड सो हेयर लेट अस वट इज है इस मॉलिक्यूल को मैंने जस्ट सिंपली यू कैन ड्रॉ कर कर सकते हो कि बिकॉज़ अगर मैं इसको ऊपर खींचू दे आर गोइंग टू कम ट्रांसफर इच अदर सो व्हेन यू आर कैरिंग आउट अ रिएक्शन बिटवीन दीस टू व्हाट वी आर फॉर्मिंग इज दिस एसिडल दिस इज व्हाट वी आर फॉर्मिंग सो इन द मिक्सचर व्हाट आर यू आर गोइंग टू हैव यू आर गोइंग टू हैव इज दी दीस टू मिक्सचर्स ऑफ डाइस्टीरियोमर्स नाउ काफी देयर मेनी मेथड्स व्हाट दे कैन डू प्रॉब्ली दे कैन कैरी आउट दी कॉलम क्रोमेटोग्राफी व्हेन यू डू अ टीएलसी इफ दे दीस टू आर सेपरेट स्पॉट्स यू कैन सेपरेट बाय कॉलम क्रोमेटोग्राफी और Sometime what happens when you are carrying out the deprotection? Okay, what you did basically you did the protection, and when you are carrying out the deprotection, sometime what is observed one of the compound is selectively deprotected, whereas the other stays as such. This happens with a lot of compounds as well, which is uh, what we call this kinetic resolution. That is something we are going to talk about sometime. If there is any other question, I have to, but I do not want to go into that concept. So. but we did the reaction with this we formed the mixture of diastereomers just the bottom line is this can be easily separated so the correct option was option number 2 oh, one aapka kyun nahi hoga kyunki one two have is a one three diol which is trans agar aap iska confirmation bhi draw karke dekhe so this is going to be axial and this is going to be equatorial so this is just not aligned at all this is axial and this is equatorial this is not properly aligned to undergo acidal formation with the compound so that is the reason why one cannot be a correct answer so this was the correct answer and that is how you could have approached this particular problem okay so thanks a lot for watching the video have a good day bye